Hey, it's me, Curtis P. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Sims 4 house building video. Before we jump into this, if you have not already watched my brand new Sims 4 house building video that I released this weekend, please go and check it out. Click on the annotation on screen right now to head on over there, and then you can come back and watch this video. Now, today's house building video comes via the request of Fizzmaja. Nailed it. I would love to see a gaming room. Just a fun room with art stuff and other stuff that your Sims could enjoy. Well, Fuzzamajada. Nailed it again. Let's do that. Let's build a fun gaming room. I'm just going to do a weird sort of shape. I don't really have. There's really no purpose for it to be this shape. It's just the shape that I want it to be. So let's go in and let's put in some doors and some windows. Some there that there windows, you know, windows. Um, what do I want for windows? I could put like these in, some modern windows. Modern, modern style. That modern style dough. All right, let's choose this. Let's choose, let's choose. I love wood floors because I think they look the nicest. So much wood though. Uh, let's have the grain go in this direction. Fun fact, you can use the arrow, the little little triangle brackety things to change the way the wood grain goes. If you wanted to know that for some reason, um, which is what I just did. So let's find some sort of cool, um, I love exposed brick. I think everyone knows that by now. I'm a huge fan of exposed bricks. So we're gonna put some exposed brick on that side. On that there side there. I do want something that's fun. Something that's very like, like video gamey. Uh, I know there's this thing, which is like the spot sort of design, which I think is kind of cool. Um, let's not do gray, let's do red. Let's do red, red is pretty sweet. There's a lot of red, ooh, so much red. So much red. There we go, it's kind of a fun, different type of room, you know? little different from your traditional. There we go, we can even make that red. Can I make that red with the... Uh, yeah, we'll just do it like that. Uh, we do need some wind, there's some uh, lights. Lighting is important for our Sims to enjoy. Uh, this is brand new light that came with the new update inside of the, the entire game for the half walls. So I'm gonna use those lights because they're kind of a simplistic Kind of a little pot light, and I really enjoy them, so we're using those. So gaming related items here. Let's go into activities and skills, and let's find some gaming stuff. So we have, obviously, I think we need to in, uh, put in one of these. What's this thing? They're basically the same. This one is fun level 10. How is this one more fun? I don't understand. Well, we're going to put one of these in, obviously. This is one of the gaming mats, so your Sims can play holographic type games. So we have to have one of these in here, obviously. We also need some sort of, how do I want this to go? I think I'm gonna put, um, we need obviously like a TV. That is an important part of all of this. We need to find electronics, we need to find televisions, we need to find wall-mounted televisions, something like that. I need a wall-mounted TV. We need a comfort-based uh, seat, something that's really comfy. Um, I kinda wanna go with like something like this. It's very like, different and we'll go with something that's like a dark if I could find some sort of black that would be great dark blue would be okay I wouldn't hate it could go with red but then it's just like it's so matchy matchy do we go with blue I feel like blue is just like me it's so it stands out so much that I'm like man I don't really know if I like it or not uh, also that is so far away from there like I feel like the logical place for that would be here Hmm, what do I want with this? I think I am gonna put it there. It's just gonna have like, there's a whole bunch of room in front of this. Uh, and I don't know if I like this couch. I don't think I actually do. Let's get rid of that couch. Let's put in this couch because I know it's the couch that I really deep down inside really want to put in, so. And we're gonna just keep it as a black couch because I don't really care. Cause I don't really care. Let's put in some half walls here. Half walls. Doot -doot -doot. Draw some half walls in here, like that. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. There we go. We can also change the styling of the top of the half walls. Uh, and I'm going to use something that's kind of a white, like that. Actually, can I make these shorter? I think there are shorter half walls. There are. 
that's not very short. These are really short. Like too short. There we go. That's shorter, which is nice. It's kind of what I want. So they're not like super tall. But they kind of angle off that little area and like this is the gaming area, the gaming zone. The zone for gaming. Let's do, I need a surface. I need some sort of coffee table, coffee related table. Coffee related table. Could use a rock, just a giant rock. Um, I kind of want to use this. It's kind of like a modern take on this. I could put it like that if I really wanted to, and then sort of leave this area a little bit more open. Uh, let's do something like that. It's a little bit darker. And then we're going to put in a rug, decorations, flooring. Uh, is there any sort of like weird, that's, that rug is gigantic, gigantic. That is a huge rug. That rug is gigantic, man. It's a huge rug. Okay, this rug will be fine. Something with like a gray tone or kind of like, I don't really know what matches. Yeah, that's kind of fine. That's all right. It's just such a huge rug. I wish I could find one that was smaller. Like, maybe this circle one is better. I like that better. It's just, it's just not as big, which is the problem. It was just such a huge freaking rug. Let's go with the blue one. Blue? I don't know. I'm really bad at, like, choosing colors. Sure, we'll go with the blue. Eh, I think the blue one looks weird. Let's go with a... Could we do black and red. I think that looks cool. Black and red. Black and red. Black and red. I could use this, too, the peace sign. I don't want the peace sign one. Okay, so we've got that there. I feel like this kind of should go in like the corner area. I don't want it to take up too much room though. Kind of like that. I'm gonna shove this, well, I guess it can go against that wall. Kind of like that, I guess. What's the grid? What is the grid? What is the grid, you know? What is the grid? Let's find a, a piece of art for the walls. Some sort of like pop art kind of idea. This is kind of what I was thinking of. Something big. Some sort of very large pop art, which does not fit. Oh, here we go. This would be sweet. I could put that in there. It kind of works. I feel like it would work better on this wall, but it's just... Like, it would work better if this whole thing could be centered, but I just don't have the space for it to be centered, unfortunately. Unless I put this in here against this wall, and we did this like this. This actually might work better. Like that, and then this here, kind of. And then we just kind of delete that. And we actually, what we should do is I'm gonna grab smaller half walls here, kind of like this, and I'm gonna put one on this side too. Copy that over, and we're gonna copy this like this and like this. So we get this kind of like chill area that's over here. Like when you walk in, you kind of enter, enter the chill area. Ba -da -da. Let's put this on the wall like that. A little bit lower, actually. Eh, okay, a little bit higher. There, and then we're gonna put that centered, and then we're gonna put another chair. This like I think this flows a lot better. Uh, comfort, chair, chaise. There we go. Let's put in kind of like this on an angle, kind of like that. Make it black. Let's also, I'm going to grab this and I'm going to put this on this wall over here too. So it's kind of, so there are two walls that have this sort of brick pattern on them. Uh, we will put that there in the very center of this whole thing. Okay, let's go back into activities and skills. Some more game-related items here. Um, we'll put in a chess table because, you know, all about that chess lifestyle. The chess lifestyle. Comfort, chairs. Um, where are those? There's some, like, really cool. Oh, they're locked. No, they're locked. And I didn't unlock all the items, so we'll go with those black chairs instead. Uh, okay, activities and skills. What else should we put in here? Let's just go down the line of, like, cool things we should add to the room. It's all like workout related items. What is this thing? Elementary display rack. No, I don't really care about that. 
Um, we could put in a guitar. That wouldn't be too bad. I wouldn't hate on that. Um, kids, I guess. What do they have for, like, random things that are toys? That are toys! Nothing really. Uh, electronics? We don't really have a gaming machine, which is super annoying. Uh, we do need a speaker. A sound system. Gotta get that sound system. Sound system. Sound system. Sound system. And then we'll put some speakers on the walls back here. So you know you get that surround sound aspect. Surround sound. Wow. Put an iPad there. Gotta have that there iPad. Uh... Lighting, kids, storage, appliances. There's not really any of the games and stuff, are there? Kind of six. It's kind of unfortunate. Um, there's nothing really that I'm missing here. Let's put in, we'll put in a surface. Let's put in a desk. I could put in like one of these. It's very like, kind of matches the other desk, the, that one. Sort of like a darker tone and texture here. Which one are we using on this? Oh, it's white and gray. Okay, so it's like that one. And then we'll grab one of these chairs from over here. We'll put that in there. And we'll put in a electronic. And we'll put this in here. Oops, delete. White. There we go, we'll put that in like that. And we'll put in some more like decorative based items here. So we'll put in some Kleenex box. You know, that photo of that pear that you once had. It's very important to you, so you keep it like on your desk. It's a crucial lifestyle choice. Uh, those are toothbrushes. We do not want toothbrushies. Toothbrush eyes. Uh, what are these? These are pens. That's some more clutter based items. There we go, we put those like that. And then we'll put these like kind of in the corner, right around over here. Uh, we do need some sort of shades and stuff because it's a game room after all. We're probably not going to have these open all the time. We'll just put in these ones. These ones are simple enough. I don't want red. I have so much red going on. I guess that, there's no black. Why are there no black? Why is that not coming black? Ugh. the worst. Um, there's literally nothing else that's like, I could do like a bamboo, I guess. It's kind of a weird thing, though. Uh, how did these not come in black? Neither of these do. This one comes in a gray, but it's just so ugly. Yeah, I want that. I guess we'll do, like, the gray for that one. Whatever. Uh, we'll find another painting for this wall over here. I want some sort of, like, this stuff is kind of cool. I used this in my last... Uh, oh, this one is huge. Look at this. Can't intersect other objects. Well, give me a second. Didn't realize you would, oh, why can't you? No, you won't go there. Probably because that other piece of art is just so big. Or that, that thing is in the road, actually, I think. Uh, let's just put some of these in the walls here. I love an idea of like, like an image collage. So it's kind of like a weird collection. How big are you? You're pretty small. You can fit right there. This one doesn't fit anywhere, unfortunately. Some posters. They don't really fit. They will in a second. And the cheat code has been activated. Cheat code. There we go. We'll put that one there. This one here. It's the ultimate, like, like, this is where you put all of the posters all of the time inside of this house. Um, for some reason, you have, like, a random, like, uh, just these like random like furniture based posters. Like why do you have them? Don't ask questions, you just have them. They're just there. Guess we should have it not go on top of this rock because otherwise it looks like very fake. Um, what else? Are there any other cool posters? Not really, these ones are all locked. So I kind of like that. It's just a collage, like a hodgepodge of everything that's going on there. Um, let's put some plants in apparently. I feel like you wouldn't have plants in this room though. We'd have like weird like art collections. Do we put one of these guys in the corner? Like I feel like we do, just for like random. No, it looks really weird, I don't like that actually. I was gonna say, if I could get it in a weird color, I totally would, because it would just be one of those like weird items you would have as a weird collector, but 
I don't really like that. Here we go. I think that's basically good enough. I think that's like your standard, like average kind of like gamer room. Like you've got all your fundamentals. Oh, this guy's kind of in a weird spot. Let's move this kind of right here. There we go, now you have a guitar there. So it kind of covers it. It's an ultimate like hangout room for sure. And I think primarily like that's the important part. Well guys, hopefully you enjoyed this room building video. If you did and you want to see more room building videos, well make sure you hit up that subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. Join the club full of other simmers here on my channel who enjoy building type videos. I'm releasing new room building videos throughout the week and house building videos on the weekend. So make sure you check that out. You can also find me on the many social media platforms in which I am on. There is an annotation down below. And of course, as I said at the beginning of the video, make sure you check out my newest house building video. There is an annotation on screen right now for that. So please check it out. Until next time, everyone, I'm Curtis Parody. Have yourself a great day and happy simming.